hello and welcome back so now before adding the mobile inputs first of all we will add the score manager so we will show the total number of kills for the player team and the total number of kill for the enemy team as well right here inside this player ui let's create a ui panel let's change into scene mode double click on this panel there it is let's resize this panel okay like that and then move it right there okay these two boxes as you can see now let's make this on the top center let's check it out there it is let's put it right there move a little bit on this side okay now let's duplicate this and move it right here okay it looks good that's it now this one will be the player score panel and then the next one will be the enemy score panel and let's select both of them and let's make them a little bit darker okay make its color black and then like that as you can see it looks good like this now inside this uh, player score let's create a ui text and let's name this text as player score counter and let's do the same for the enemy score as well so ui legacy text let's name this as enemy score counter now in the player score counter let's change this text to 0 make the font size 20 and right here let's select this font the 30 or 40 actually let's just make it 50 okay then select the text and resize this text so that it matches the whole thing and let's put it on the center and then in the middle like that as you can see now it looks really good now let's do the same for this one it's 0 50 center then in the middle and now let's resize it and also let's select the font so if we see it in this view as you can see it looks really good like that now after this let's create a ui panel again let's name this panel as win slash lose board let's resize this panel so from here let's move it up there and let's do that and now let's bring it down here that's it let's make it fully transparent and in here we will now show the text so ui legacy text and in here we will type team need 10 kills to win that's it make the font size 20 make it bold and let's fit this whole panel like that now let's 
move it to the center and down below we can change this as well so as you can see now it looks really good like that but actually we need to make the react transform of it at the top center and after that let's move it down below again like that that's it now if you see it in the game view there it is and now in the mobile view it, is, it will be shown like this okay so now we have all of these things set up now in the next video we will type a script so whenever we kill the enemy the player score will be increased and whenever the enemy kill one of our player then this will increase as well and actually the last thing which we will we can do is to change the color of this so let's change the color of our player score text to something like blue and the enemy text color to red okay that's it so that we know which one is the player text and which one is the enemy text so catch you guys in the next one